and welcome to my channel. So for today's tutorial I will be doing Octavia's hair from the TV show The 100. I love The 100 and you guys have requested me to do Octavia's hair for such a long time now so I thought it was about time I did it. So I've been checking out a few pictures of her and it seems like she has her hair in different ways but they're really similar so I'm just going to kind of recreate one of them. I don't know which one it is, but since they're so similar, I don't think it really matters so much. Yeah, that's what we're doing today, so just keep watching and let's get started. Okay, so first off, let's just ignore my greasy hair, but it should be okay this time since Octavia's hair is probably pretty greasy too. Anyway, I'm going to start doing her half ponytail fishtail braid. So I'm pulling about a third of my hair back into a half ponytail. I split that section into two and I start fishtail braiding on the back of my head. This braid is really simple to make so you just have to follow two easy steps. If you don't know how to fishtail braid, you can click right here to get to my fishtail tutorial. If you already know how to do it, then just keep watching. Now that the fishtail braid is done, I'm going to braid two Dutch braids horizontally on the left side of my head. First off, I'm splitting the hair horizontally in the middle and I clip the top section away. I'm starting to braid the bottom braid and I braid this just behind my ear. I also have a tutorial right here if you don't know how to make a three strand Dutch braid. Here I go through all the steps on how to make one. Always make sure to braid tightly against your head or the braid will turn out loose and it won't lay flat against your head. When I braided that behind my ear, I stop adding strands of hair into the braid and I keep braiding a normal three strand braid all the way down and then I secure it with a clear elastic. I take out the top layer and create the exact same braid but I don't move on to a three strand braid until I've dutch braided a bit further away from my ear than the bottom braid. Now that the left side is done, I'm moving on to my right side. And this time I only do the top dutch braid instead of having two of them. When the braid is done, I'm going to grab just a small section of hair beside that braid and I'm going to braid a normal three strand braid. I have no products in my hair right now and I haven't straightened it or anything but if you want more textured hair or straight hair or anything you can just go right ahead and use any products you like, like texturizing spray for more texture and hold, you can also tease your hair for more volume, vice versa. Here I just went through on how to do the braiding part. And that's the finished look! And that's it, 
I hope you guys like this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give a thumbs up if you like this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!